before there was Jamie Thomas, before there was Jeremy Ray, before Chris Markovich, and before Pat Duffy, there was Frankie Hill. He was basically the height of stunt innovation. Considering the populace of pro skateboarding looked like Corey O'Brien, Eric Dressen, Scott Oster. It wasn't until years later that Pat Duffy dropped the part in the questionable video that people really started to catch on to that level of insanity on the skateboard. I think you know, just trying like, to, you know. That's over 20 years ago. That's you know, gnarly, right? God. Talk about time for a fucking documentary, right? Jesus Christ. I know, right? It's like, Jesus, you know, everyone else has, it's like, everyone else has a damn documentary. I see documentaries in parking lots. So why the fuck is there one on Frankie Hill, right? I know, right? So, I mean, would it be fair to say if Nottis and Gons were the Wright brothers of handrail skating, that mm. Frankie Hill was like the Chuck Yeager? Like, That's good. I like that. You like that? Yeah, he's like, definitely, for sure. Because that's the thing I'm yeah. trying to like describe to kids, like you know, they, if if they know history at all, they know the Wright brothers are the first ones to fucking be in flight. Yeah, they but Chuck Yeager's are doing to break the sound barrier. There you go. Yeah. I think if anyone, like basically the way it was, is Gons, you know, did open the gap handrail. I mean, Gons and Nottis, like the Federal Building right over here, hands down, you know, they went there with Johnny Cop one day and fucking, they both did it, like. Gon's Nottis, Gon's has the gaps. I mean, for sure, you credit that. But then in between, like, Duffy and Gon's, like, there's kind of a, there's kind of a blank spot. And Frankie Hill, like, really is that spot. Like, nobody can deny it. So, Frankie, tell us a little bit about this uh, deal. Okay. Well, we used to have these things called Adam's Jams where people brought jump ramps here and everybody would show up and they would skate the jump ramp. And it was a lot of fun and we did the wall rides here and uh, had a lot of fun. And every time I left, I used to come up this ramp and daydream that I was just gonna huck some ollie over this bar here and um, somehow land on that pavement and roll into the grass. Um, I don't know, I think I was kind of fantasizing a little too much, but it was definitely a daydream of mine. It's the old Adam's ollie.